spectroscopy. This is what our product looks like, the Nano IR2. And uh, so we start out with an optical microscope view, um, and we select an area of interest where we want to perform a measurement. We're going to bring the AFM tip down to the sample, start scanning the sample, and create a conventional uh, atomic force microscope image. And then we can select any location in the AFM image and uh, uh, arrange to perform the IR analysis, the chemical analysis. So we bring our cantilever tip down, and we're going to start sending pulses of infrared radiation uh, at the uh, uh, apex of the tip, uh, at the sample uh, in the region that we are interested in. If we tune to a wavelength where the sample absorbs, then that infrared light excites the molecules in the sample. Part of that light turns into uh, heat and causes a rapid thermal expansion of the sample. And that thermal expansion of the sample kicks the cantilever into oscillation. And this, these blue traces up on the top are basically the deflection of the cantilever every time we have a burst of infrared radiation absorbed by the sample. Um, and then what we can do is we can create absorption spectra from the response of that cantilever, uh, basically measuring the amplitude of oscillation as a function of wave number or wavelength. And then each of these peaks corresponds to a specific molecular vibration. Then we can uh, uh, measure these at a series of different points to get spatially resolved chemical analysis. Thank you.